Unfolding the Secrets of Dog-Eared Pages. Hello, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're diving into the picturesque world of idiomatic expressions. Specifically, we'll unravel the meaning behind the phrase, dog-eared. Stick with us to explore its origins, uses, and how it can enrich your English vocabulary. The term, dog-eared, refers to the condition of a book or a page where the corners have been folded over, resembling the shape of a dog's ear. This is often done to mark one's place in a book or to note important pages for quick reference. It's a phrase that vividly captures a common practice among readers. The phrase dates back to at least the 16th century and has been a colorful part of the English lexicon ever since. It's a testament to the longevity of print and the universal habit of readers trying to keep their place in a story without a bookmark. Let's put our phrase into action. If you say, I've dog-eared several pages in my favorite novel, it means you've folded the corners of several pages. It can also be used metaphorically. For example, this recipe book is dog-eared from years of use, implies that the book is well-loved and frequently referenced. While dog-earing is a handy practice, it's also important to note that it can damage books. In some circles, especially among book collectors or libraries, dog earing is frowned upon. It's always best to use a bookmark to preserve the pages of your books, especially if they're not your own. And that's a wrap on dog eared. We hope this expression adds a charming detail to your conversations and helps you visualize the cozy habit of countless readers. Until next time, Keep turning those pages, and maybe use a bookmark instead of dog-earing them. Happy learning!